Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'll be making Mexican shredded beef. Basically, it's dehydrated seasoned shredded beef and it's perfect for tacos, burritos, tostadas and many more. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please click the subscribe button. Let's get started. Let's check out the ingredients for this recipe. First, let's make seasoning for beef. I'm adding a tablespoon of garlic powder, a tablespoon of onion powder, a tablespoon of cumin powder, a tablespoon of black pepper powder, one tablespoon of roasted paprika powder, one and a half tablespoons of chili powder, a teaspoon of salt. Mix this well. You can always adjust the spice to your taste. For this recipe, I'm using one kilo beef chunk. You may also use beef cubes. Add the beef into a pressure cooker and rub the seasoning on all sides. To this, I'm adding two cups of beef stock. Instead of beef stock, you can also use beef cubes. Cover and cook on a low heat for about one to one and a half hours, depends upon the meat. It's been cooking for more than an hour. Turn off the flame. Let it sit for 5 to 10 minutes. Let the pressure come down. Beef has cooked perfectly. It's so soft and tender. Use a pair of fork to shred the beef. Mix the meat well with the gravy and set it aside. Let's make salsa. For that into a bowl, add 1 cup of chopped onion, 1 cup of chopped tomatoes, 2 tablespoons of coriander leaves, 2 tablespoons of jalapeno pickle a tablespoon of lemon juice a pinch of salt give all of this a nice mix keep the flame on low heat Once the pan is hot enough, place a tortilla wrap. On the tortilla wrap, add some gravy and spread well. Add some mozzarella cheese. Add a good amount of shredded beef. Finally, some salsa on top. Fold it, let it toast for a minute or two to get that crunchy texture. I really hope you enjoy this recipe. If you do, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. 
do share it with your family and friends and also share your thoughts about this recipe in the comment section below for more videos click on the left to check out my previous video and on the right my other recipes thank you all so much for watching stay safe stay healthy happy cooking